I'm dressed for success, and this is the cast. With Mac, your best friend. Shake down, you make me break. For goodness sake, I think I'm on the edge. Something new with you. I haven't really made a video for a while. I just didn't think it was that interesting for like a week. But do not worry. I am interesting yet again. You know what? That was a cool intro. I could probably like reuse that song for a million times, just random close to the cast. For goodness sake, I think I'm on the edge. For goodness sake, I think I'm on the edge. Yeah, some of you emailed me, asked me that I've been working on some bigger plans and videos lately. And yep. And of course, school is starting soon again, so I gotta get prepared for that. My top, uh, my top, top hat, top gun, topical steroid anesthetic. My top asked for video was on homosexuality. And yeah, I'll do a, a video about that because I got some interesting opinions that I'm not sure many people have like ever heard or thought of. Same thing on HIV AIDS, marijuana, got some good history and uh, stuff on the legal and on the health course. Smoking, eventually. Obesity, totally. Philosophy, gotta get more of that in. Science experiments, totally. I haven't done any yet. I will most definitely do awesome ones. No baking soda and vinegar. Where happened the real stuff? I will recreate my famous how to construct an atomic bomb speech at Northwestern University. Got some ideas for some totally awesome animations for that. Get in there, the theory of war, a theory of happiness. DDT, very awaited video. Moat of dust, maybe why America needs to get to space. Uh, article by Neil deGrasse Tyson and Parade astrophysicist. You should be creator of Smithsonian, I believe. He's the guy that hosts Nova about now. A new free learning video. This one's about Yale. I just read the article today. How they just failed. Copyright. Hate crimes. Are you ready for the cast? I sure am. It's time for the... <laughs> comment bag. The comment bag is where I read viewer comments. A three-part comment. The Quick Spin writes, Freedom of speech referred to the liberty to speak freely when it came to political affiliation and morality of ethics. In many countries, you were put to death for speaking against your lordship. In England, you were beheaded. The Caesar, death. Nazi Germany, death. Feudal Japan, you never spoke against the emperor. In America, we can speak our political views and ethics without repercussions. If you want to limit it, if you want to limit it so something as a menial or profanity, the context of the amendment is buried. Firebird comments agreed. L I L Lil Nip sixty seven also says. The quick spin. It was very well said. I'm watching this with my, as of two days ago, 12-year-old son. He probably got a more clear understanding from what you said than from anyone else in here. Thanks. I was really surprised about amount the, the amount of like parents that watch the cast with their kids. I had no idea. Thanks, quick spin. Let's see. Then, because uh, I just, I like that one because... Most of the comments that you read under some of my video on the, the profanity video are kind of unintelligent, but I feel like I that would be right to delete them because I don't know why. Anyway, this one because some see this one's un, this one's an Italian uh, from the Italian YouTube. So this is what he writes: Noxiousville writes from Italy. Lol, he's right. Tyrant Rave AB, you should be a politician, because your analogies would make perfect sense to stupid people. The word fuck and the word fudge, when used in an angry context, mean the same fucking thing, but people like you think it's better to say fudge, so go fudge yourself. And then the comments on how I look are like the best. Like this guy, Dr. Poopy. That chick in the vid is ugly as fuck. Thanks. And then uh, if you look at another video, I forgot what this one's from. But Capricia writes, I like it. I love your hair. And then a little smiley thing. It's cute. And the person right under her, or him, says, 
Young Jezza. WTF, get you our big ugly head out of my compute screen and you are a fucking fag, diz, gay, Clyde guy. Username logically replies generally to those kinds of comments. Based on the depth and intellect behind your comment, I think you're pissed because he's using words with more than one syllable, and worse, there aren't even any pictures. Metalhead217 said, Hell yeah, rock the fuck on, man. You know I do. I'm sure you remember the still life from BFF slash Making a Drink, a still life painted with associated music. <laughs> Oprah Angramirov, please pay our respects, seems to have been shot in the head while watching the cast. His last comment with his head fell down into the keyboard reads as follows. <laughs> 